It's time for these players to step up and do well for this club. It's time to step up for Manchester United. It's time to step up for Eric Ten Hag. As our next three games are very crucial to our future for next season. Three very, very, very difficult fixtures. Because playing against Everton is not always easy. They're very good defensively. And we don't really score much goals against Everton. Playing Everton is always a struggle for us. And playing against Liverpool in the FA Cup. Losing that game means we are out of the FA Cup. And out of um, the chance to win a trophy for this season. And then... Losing also against Brentford means top four hopes, top five hopes is totally gone. It's time for these players to step up. It's time for these players to prove that they are fit to play for this club. It's time to prove that they are behind everything hard. And it's time to prove that they, um, they are, they, they are, the loyalty, um, to the fans and to the club. Because it's a very, very crucial time for everything hard. After these three games, everything hard could be gone. But yeah, these are the training videos for today that are coming out. You can see a lot of youth players there. Because we have lots of um, uh, senior players injured, um, so we have many youth players. You can see um, their faces. Some some of them we have been seeing um, regularly throughout the whole season. Um, but also, Rasmus Holland. There are rumors that Rasmus Holland could be back for this game on Saturday against Everton. But right here, right now, we would have to wait for Ten Hag's pre-match press conference tomorrow to confirm that information. I can't give you for sure, but there are rumors that Rasmus Holland could be back. And of course, if he is back, that would be very, very, very important for us. That would be very, very crucial for us. That gives us even more chances of winning that game. But with us, as much Highland, the chances of us winning that game are slim. But, I've said this before, with the players we have now, Rashford, Ganacho, Anthony, and the rest in that, in that um, front line, we are still good enough to beat Everton. So there's no excuses, honestly. No excuses at all. You can see them all smiling in the... In the training session, I hope that at the back of their mind, they know that this, the upcoming games are a must win. You can smile, you can laugh in training, but on the pitch, you have to be a monster. I can condone it smiling now, but on Saturday, I want to see monsters on the pitch, not smiling or on the training pitch and smiling on the match pitch. That will not be acceptable at all because the hard job is on the line. Like I said, his job is on the line and any, maybe they, they might have already decided to suck him. Maybe. But right here, right now, we can't have that mentality. The mentality is to win every game. Because if we can win every game, then top four chances or top five chances are becomes more realistic. And then maybe winning the trophy can also become realistic. And then external saving the job could also become more realistic. Because maybe right now, they have already decided to sack him. Maybe they have already said that no matter how the season goes, he's still going to remain. But we don't know. The mentality we have to have is win every game. Because we are Manchester United. We can beat anybody and we should be able to beat every but, but yes, after, after Everton, Liverpool and Brentford, you have Chelsea and Liverpool again in the Premier League. So our next five fixtures are very, 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 um, very, very hard. But the first three are the most important ones because after the first three, we go on international break. So, but the first three are very, very important. The next three rather are very, very important for our future, for Everton's future. You can see Rashford in the training pictures there. So he's back and he's okay. As for new players coming on from injury, let's give you any any um injury updates until the house uh until the house comes out in the press conference and gives that update. Because right now in the training pictures, we're not seeing any, anyone new. We're just seeing players that we have been seeing um all along that we know that are fit and ready to play. So it's time for the players to prove their worth. It's time for the players to step up, step up and save this manager's job. Step up and show that they are behind this manager and step up and do well in the next three fixtures so that we can end the season on a high. And that's just it.